Stroke is a leading cause of disability in the United States. About six and a half million stroke survivors live in the U.S. today, and there are about 800,000 new strokes just in the United States alone. This research is aimed at improving balance rehab among patients who experience a stroke, specifically by providing them visual feedback using uh, the Nintendo Wii Balance Board. What's interesting about working with someone like Jim Schmiedler is he's not necessarily the typical engineer. He's, a, he's very much a proponent of involving the end users in the design of the system. This particular project really falls in line with the mission of the university of not just to, to explore research for its own sake, but also to look at the positive impact it can have outside of the university's walls. The uh, advantage to the community is that you know, something's being generated here. Rather than, than Notre Dame doing education and, and Memorial doing healthcare, having the two facilities come together, two organizations come together to work on a project together, I think it, it, it can gather interest in the community and show that we can do more than just what each individual uh, organization can do by themselves. With traditional therapy, the therapist is typically watching and feeling what the patient's doing, but it's hard for us to give feedback as to how the patient is performing. With the Wii, we can give them visual and auditory feedback, and they can see um, objective data, which really helps them to see how they're improving. What really attracted me about the WeHab project was that it allowed me to do uh, engineering, but in a way that would help other people. It's good. I liked it a lot. Well, when at home, they're good. No. Something that you're used to and comfortable with. Yeah. I think it's really great that Jim is being recognized for this project which really highlights how well the local community is able to benefit from the research done here at Notre Dame. To provide more for a patient than what either of us could provide on our own. Our job as engineers is to develop systems that didn't exist before. And there's nothing more gratifying than developing a system that's going to directly benefit the lives of people in your own community.